Well, we are all about pets, all four pets, and we're all about helping you keep them happy and healthy. And we want to welcome back Mike Palmer from our friends at Premier Pet Supply. And with Mike today, his partner, Brandon Thorne from the location in Novi. Good morning, Brandon. Good morning. Good to see you both. Morning. Mike, How are you? I feel like I just saw you. We did. I think that was yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> we have a picture we'll show you of Mike and I at a, an event um, for Birmingham Youth Assistance. We were at the dog show. Hey. You're looking good, Jason. Uh, you looking good as well. A couple, of, a couple of dog uh, appreciators there and we had a great time hanging out with all the fun furry friends there. That was a lot of fun, yeah. So were you there, Jason, to learn how to beef up Charlie Tickle's diet by any chance? No, we were just there to hope to win maybe a category or two. And okay. Charlie Tickles did not win despite our best attempts at a float. He saw the float. Yeah, right. it, was, it was cute. And I tried really hard to get your daughter to uh, win there. And that $100 bribe went really well. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll make sure to get I'll, I'll, I'll donate it back to Birmingham Youth Assistance, That's which a good that one. kid's dog show was for. That was a lot of fun. That's but it was. a good one. So uh, let's start with ways to beef up your dog's diet. Sure. Well, a couple things we want to talk about first and foremost is February is Pet Dental Health Month. Mm. So uh, dental health is something that is a big deal. Over 80% of dogs and cats out there have um, the uh, pre-existing periodontal disease or the beginning stages of it. So keeping the teeth healthy is super important and there's a lot of ways to do that. First and foremost, just like us, brushing is important. It's not always the easiest thing to do, but it's always great to remember when you do brush uh, dog or cat's teeth, they cannot have toothpaste with fluoride. Fluoride right. can be something that can be detrimental to them. So natural toothpaste with enzymes do a great job. And that finger toothbrush that Jason's holding up is actually a great way to unobtrusively get in the dog's mouth or the cat's mouth and brush the teeth. And it's always good to follow up with a little treat, make it fun, because right. sometimes they may not enjoy it. Right. So we've got a lot of different treats. And honestly, what uh, was interesting is just giving bones in general mm -hmm. helps to scrape that plaque and tartar. I think people assume that uh, larger kibble or crunching on a kibble will help scrape plaque and tartar, but it won't. It would be as if we were eating potato chips and that would help scrape plaque and tartar. That's not the same. Okay. Um, one thing a lot of people don't recognize or realize is uh, frozen raw bones like we have here are something that's really, really good to help with uh, the teeth. And it's something that uh, you know they do really well with. It's great for any size dog. I was gnawing on one of those during the Super Bowl last night. <laughs> yeah, the bones up front. Smoked bones are good as well. You don't have to keep those in the freezer. They still have that raw element to them. They're smoked, they got a really good smell to them. They still have the meat and the marrow on them. Um, so those are always a, a fan favorite for sure. Okay. And um, so ad additional things that are an issue this time of year are the dry skin and coat. We have the heat on in our house. It's cold outside so that the coat gets, you know, gets uh, to be less shiny, doesn't have that sheen, and the, the skin gets dry. So supplementing with a fish oil is ideal. So salmon oil, um, giving salmon treats, switching maybe your dog food over to a salmon option because most manufacturers do make a salmon option is a great idea. We've got fish skins, we've got mussels, mm, uh, fish skins. you know, we, different oils that have anchovy, sardine, and hemp. Uh, the omega fatty acids are really, really important. Um, we got to make sure that we uh, definitely bulk up the diet by adding those to the regular kibble. All right. So, Brandon, when they come, when people come into your store, mm -hmm. what are people looking for? Um, well, they're looking for. Um, good foods and treats, but also this time of year, um, with the cold, um, just like with people, arthritis and kind of the, mm. the soreness that happens um, this time of year. So they're looking for good hip and joint uh, items. So we have like Actify here. Uh, we have Hip Flex treats, which actually uh, uses cherries from Michigan. So the cherry, the tart uh, cherry uh, actually helps with the hips and joints. Um, they're also having digestive issues. Um, so. We have like uh, goat's milk in perfect form. It helps uh, get their stool uh, if they have a kind of loose stool. Um, goat's milk is great. Hmm. Um, so it has probiotics, uh, which helps with digestion. Uh, and if there's any kind of pain at all as well, we have uh, CBD oils, uh, which actually help with uh, pain management. Uh, for them this time of year. And that actually is a cannabinoid oil. It's uh, for a drive from the hemp plant. There's no THC in oh, it at all. I was about to say. Yeah. I was <laughs> Don't get excited. <laughs> <Okay>. but <laughs> I'm sorry. It's got, uh, the benefits to it are fantastic for um, just uh, mobility, for overall pain, anxiety, um, and uh, for calming the pet as well. Okay. I was about to say, I thought the dog would be craving some Girl Scouts. I was about to say, too. <laughs> it does help with appetite. Surprise, surprise. There's an event coming up next Sunday that Mike and the folks at Premier Pet Supply are part of involving yoga. Is this called Downward Dog? It is. It is. And uh, it's a fantastic uh, event for the whole family. And they're all invited to the Beverly Hills Club right down the street from Premier Pet Supply in Beverly Hills. Mm -hmm. um, it is a fundraiser for the Michigan Humane Society. Should be a lot of fun. The Premier Pet Supply will be providing goodie bags for uh, the first 50 people that join. 
cool. And uh, you know, yoga is great, and supporting uh, the Michigan Humane Society is something that's near and dear to our hearts. Sounds so, like a perfect combination to me. Absolutely. For more information, go to beverlyhillsclub.com if you want to learn more about Downward Dog. Thanks, guys, for being here. <laughs> right. Thank you for having us. There are <laughs> four <laughs> Premier Pet Supply locations. Brandon is in Novi along with Beverly Hills, Rochester Hills, and Livonia. To That's find right. the yes. location nearest you and to learn more about what they offer and see their specials this month, visit their website, premierpetsupply.com.